Hello, I'm Sam Sale, and I am back, baby. This time, I've got my own news show, because this random news corporation whose name I don't even remember saw my Super Bowl commercial, and they loved the way I made fun of major corporations like themselves so much that they gave me this show. Weird, right? Today, we will be talking about all the issues, all the events, and all the stories that have ever happened in the history of the world recently. Because that's what people do on new shows, right? First off, somewhere in the Middle East, there's a war going on. Lots of people have died, and it is nothing to joke about. And if I can't joke about it, I'm not going to talk about it. So moving on to more domestic affairs. President Obama got re-elected at the end of last year, and since then, everyone and their grandmas has been making up scandals to try and make him and his administration look bad. My experts at producers <clears throat> assure me that everything they are doing is for the good of the economy and you. So, no need to worry. I mean, it's not like he's a dictator or anything. What could he possibly do? So moving on to things that will actually affect you as a person, there's this bill going through Congress that will... But this is important to their lives. Yeah, yeah, I could talk about that instead. Okay. Have you guys seen that new famous person's baby? It's just so cute. In even more important news, the actor who's going to be playing the next Doctor was announced recently, which opened the floodgates from people who think that this actor is a bad, evil, and terrible choice for the role. Which opened the floodgates from people who think that people with opinions are bad, evil, and terrible. Which has brought us to what I think is the most important question of all, Doctor Who brings us to my personal favorite story today while making a deep and convicting speech about reverse racism someone who shares completely different religious beliefs than myself made a complete fool of himself the other day so now instead of listening to what he actually had to say and i be having an intellectual debate with him we can just watch youtube videos of how stupid he looks that, ladies and gentlemen, is how progress is made. Lastly, but most certainly not leastly, the situation in Detroit has gotten even worse, as the citizens of the city have now been diagnosed with the zombie virus. However, it is still probably the fault of conservative politicians who have not actually been in power there since before the classic series of Doctor Who started. But more on that next time. What is truth? What is false? What is good? And what is evil? What is fact? And what is fiction? I'm Sam Sale. And I have no idea. Good night. What do you mean fired? Oh yeah, definitely psycho.